Good morning, everyone. It's Robert from On My Turntable. Hope you're having a great morning this morning. Uh, it's Monday morning, uh, coffee kind of morning. Um, still dealing with uh, uh, my dad's situation. It's not good, but uh, I need to do these. I hope you understand. I need to have some type of outlet to deal with uh, the hurt and the pain and... Um, so what better way to do it than uh, to be with you guys and to um, do videos. Uh, it's just, again, it's just a way to release. It's nothing, I'm not trying to promote myself. I'm not trying to, whatever, I'm, I'm just, I have to do something. Uh, I'm going in a little later on uh, this morning to see him again. Um, and uh, anyway, uh, I wanted to, um, Join in on a thread, a great thread by um, the wonderful Shannon. Shannon talks music. She wants us to show her fav uh, your favorite album titles, and uh, she's very eloquent and very um, uh, I don't know. She's 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 so wonderful the way she talks and um, the words in her uh, album titles mean so much, and and the way she describes them is just wonderful. She's just remarkable person so um, I thought I'd show a few of them uh, they may not be as, as eloquent and, and great as Shannon showed you but I still want to go through them and show you here so um, so start off with this one here um, the wonderful word hallelujah uh, that could mean so many things this is canned heat by the way uh, hallelujah could mean Eureka Hallelujah could mean you're praying, right, uh, or singing uh, to uh, to your God, and um, it's just got so many meanings. And uh, I'm not sure if can't he meant it that way, but that's how I can take it. Like you can take this word uh, so many different ways. Uh, again, a celebration, um, praying to God, um, and uh, that famous song Hallelujah. And uh, so it's it's a cool cool title. So, um, this one could be taken, this is China Crisis, uh, what price paradise, um, and it could be what price is paradise, um, paradise at what price, it could be taken so many different ways, um, and, uh, this is a great album too, by the way. But, uh, yeah, what price paradise, and, uh, I think of what's happening today, not much paradise going on and uh, what price we're paying to even deal with the crap that we're paying uh, that we're dealing with now so uh, I thought that was kind of cool um, again you could put your own spin on this uh, on this saying but what price paradise uh, paradise at what price what's the cost for having paradise when do we get paradise you know that type of thing so what price paradise China crisis. Friction, just a cool word. This is Coney Hatch, great Canadian hard rock band. But friction has so many meanings. <laughs> uh, friction between friends, lovers, uh, friction between inanimate objects. Um, so many different meanings of friction. But I thought friction was a cool word. Coney Hatch. Uh, the beautiful Kate Bush, Hounds of Love. Uh, <laughs> it uh, that's quite the play on on words for sure. Um, and uh, I'm not sure what she means by that. I'd have to look more into it. I'm, I'm figuring what she she means by the Hounds of Love. But uh, I thought it was quite a cool title. An amazing album, and the again a beautiful. Beautiful woman. Uh, drastic plastic, just a fun word. This is Bebop Deluxe, a great band that uh, Mr. Glenn Calloway got me into. But uh, yeah, drastic plastic. It's, it's a cool play on on words. Um, plastic's not usually drastic, unless 
unless uh, you know you swallow it or or you I don't know there's, it's just not normally a, a, a drastic thing plastic but drastic plastic kind of cool play on words uh, this is uh, Cultosaurus erectus this is blue oyster cult uh, what a tongue twister this one is but uh, yeah and of course the imagery on the album cover says it all as well but uh, culture Cultrosaurus erectus and again another great album uh, Quinella kind of like Aqualung Quinella um, all kinds of cool words. I, I'm not sure what the meaning is of it, but it's uh, this is the Atlanta Rhythm section. But a great, great word, Quinella. Of course, you got the Q U. Um, beautiful album cover as well. But yeah, Quinella. Ring of hands. That could mean, you know. A circle, everyone holding hands. Um, ring of hands, if you have a ring on, which I don't. But um, yeah, ring of hands. This is Argent as well. Great, great band, Argent. But yeah, I thought it was kind of cool. Ring of hands. Again, it could have many meanings. Uh, you could take it so many different ways. But. Cool thing. Um, Another play on words, this is Vulture Culture. This is the Alan Parsons Project. Um, just the imagery on the, on the album cover. But Vulture Culture could mean, like we're in a Vulture Culture today. Um, there's, it's a doggy dog world out there. So uh, is it a certain culture? Uh, is it a certain mentality of people? could have many different meanings. So vulture culture. Cool play on words. 10cc deceptive bends. They always had a uh, um, aquatic theme to their uh, to a lot of their music, but uh, deceptive bends. What does that mean? Deceptive. What well, deceptive means sneaky or deceptive means uh, you know, going behind your back type of thing. But uh, deceptive bends. Bends to me in this imagery means going down deep into the water, getting the bends. Um, but um, do you get the bends when you're when you're deceived? You know, people deceive you. You get pain. You get frustration. You get all kinds of stuff. So yeah, deceptive bends. Cool stuff. And finally, uh, this is affliction. By Econoline Crush, a great Canadian hard rock band. But affliction. Um, we're afflicted by so many things. Pain, hurt, um, you know, frustration. Um, and it doesn't take much to afflict people with um, mentality, uh, um, you know, thoughts and images and culture. Um, uh, just a, a rally, you know, there, there's so many things that can afflict people. So affliction is a, is a cool word as well. You can't see it on the title here. Um, but that's what is what the album is called. This is called the affliction. But uh, great, great album and great band and uh, cool word affliction. So there you have it. Just, uh, just some cool, I could have gone on and on and on, but... Uh, um, there's so many, so many great words out there. So um, check out Shannon Talks Music. Uh, beautiful person, uh, very well spoken, very knowledgeable. Um, I'm going to put a link to her channel below. And uh, uh, if I can ask to keep you in my prayers, um, keep my dad in, in your prayers, that'd be that'd be awesome. And uh, thank you so much. And uh, thank you for being there. Thank you for letting me uh, have this outlet. And uh, we'll talk to you again soon. Bye now.